don't know me and I wouldn't have done it. And if you if I don't know you, then please why stop you? interrupting me. <laughs> the thing is, when I got down don't on one knee again, I got interrupted. Good I'm Lord. Done with this. Well, he did say please. She's emotional. Isn't it just crazy to believe that I could be sitting over here crying over a man for hours, right? Whereas he he just he just went to bed tonight. <laughs> like this situation didn't face him at all. It left me in tears crying, journaling my feelings for the past couple hours. And he just almost just sleeping away. Like nothing nothing crossed his brain twice. Is that is that just wild? Let's face the facts. Women do cry a lot more easily compared to men, and they become so used to it that they are able to cry on tap. She's having emotional problems. I just wish boys would think, like, just think for a second. I snapped him a picture like this, and you could clearly see the makeup streaks for me crying, but I had no tears under my eyes, and he was like, why were you crying? And I was like, mm, when? <laughs> and he was like, your makeup has streak, has tears down it. And I was like, oh, it's probably because I was laying down and my eyes were watering. And he was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Bitch, what? <laughs> the tear marks would be going this way. <laughs> Not down my face. <laughs> right between the lines, please. <laughs> they want to be over dramatic about everything. They expect guys to be mind readers and accuse guys of not having emotional intelligence. Hypocrisy. Women are not emotionally intelligent. And when a woman says that she wants emotional intelligence from a man, what she really means is that she wants a man to be able to change his behavior to make sure that she isn't the one being out of control with her emotions because she's not able to control them herself. It means that the men in their lives have to behave a certain way to essentially make her behave correctly because she doesn't know how to control her own self and her own emotions and she's not emotionally aware of things that are going on around her. This is 100% true because these chicks are typically not able to control their emotions at all and emotional intelligence is being able to separate yourself from your emotions. Think logically and make clear distinctions about how to choose a more logical path. Most women that scream emotional intelligence don't even know what it means it means being in control of your emotions and using logic around situations and adapting to different environments which women cannot do myself included when a woman says that she wants a man to be emotionally intelligent it means that he has to just know everything that she's feeling 24 7 seven days a week and it gives her the ability to deflect accountability and shift blame as to why he doesn't just know and we saw a prime example of this in the third clip when this chick accused a man of not being able to read through her cryptic puzzles as she cries about one thing and says something else women think that just because they're emotional it means that they're emotionally intelligent but the reality is, is that women use their emotions as an excuse for poor behavior or they use their emotions to shift blame to the men in their lives for not being emotionally intelligent when really men are more emotionally intelligent than women and women don't want to accept that or believe that so it's easier to just blame men instead. Okay bye. And this is how these 304s can get away with accusing men of so many different things. All they need to do is put on the waterworks and everybody feels sorry for them. It takes accountability away from themselves and makes it easier for everybody to blame the man. What's even worse is the man could start blaming himself just because the woman is crying, but the truth is he knows deep down that he did not do anything wrong. Try not to get caught up in this trap guys. Some women will fake cry just to manipulate you and those around them. That's very true.